Thank you, Mr. Chair. Uh, let me just state this, um, and for the members of the gay community, it was very interesting that I took a position when I went before the Gertrude Stein organization, which is a gay democratic organization, and I stood before all of them and said I was not in support of gay marriage in the District of Columbia. And you know what was interesting after that statement? They endorsed me as their candidate for Ward 7 Council. They did not agree with my position, but they endorsed me because they realized all of the good work that I have done for the gay community and all of the support that I've give, given them. So when I did not agree on that one issue, they did not negate all the good works that I did. The ministers, on the other hand, have been great support to me, and I see some of my Ward 7 ministers in the audience. As a matter of fact, some of the ministers are even my neighbors. I have two ministers that live on Highwood Drive, where I reside. And the ministers have really upset me to the point that they have questioned um, my Christianity. They have questioned my morality. So on the other end of that, where if you don't agree with gay marriage, the ministers are applauding and, you know, they're saying that you are, you know, not supportive, that you are a bigot. On the other hand, the ministers are saying that you're not a Christian and you're not a moral person if you support um, this. And, and let me just state for the record, this is a question of fairness, of recognizing what other states recognize. I can honestly say I'm still... I'm still at odds with the issue of gay marriage in the District of Columbia. I still want to see some more. I still want to learn more about that issue. But I do know one thing, that I do know that everyone is equal under God. And there are a lot in the gay community that are at your very churches, in your congregation. Please know this for the record, that I am going to vote in support of this measure and know that there is no one more committed to the people of the District of Columbia and Ward 7 know that I am a Christian and God is first and foremost in my life. So on both ends of this, don't go to the extreme because this is a very difficult issue and we love everyone. So I would ask the ministers and the gay community to please work together that you too, and you're in this very room today, need to come up with a viable solution, need to learn what each other are talking about coming to me, I'm a heterosexual African-American woman, so I do not understand all the dynamics of what the gay community is going through. I don't understand all the dynamics of what the ministers are arguing about, but there was one important point, because it's very important to me that it should not be put upon the religious community. If you do not agree um, with gay marriage, I don't feel that you should be imposed upon to perform um, that ceremony in your institution. And I was informed that this is a civil marriage, that it would not be put upon um, the churches to perform these ceremonies, if so. And that was a point that was brought up to me, too. But please, I, I, I want all your prayer, and I know this community wants all your prayer, and I would implore all of you to come together as a community and not to point fingers at the members on this dais, not to point fingers at the gay community and not to point at ourselves, but we need to all come together and work at this. And please, I implore you, and that's not everyone, because I know my ministers in Ward 7 have been supportive and really love me, but for those of you who say you're going to run a Christian candidate against me in the next, collect, in the next election, I just want you to know that I'm a Christian candidate too, so I will proudly run against them two Christians running against each other. But I, I really love all my ministers. I understand your point, but let's all work together. I will be in support of this measure, but there are other things coming down the pike, and this is not um, the end to this um, subject. This is only the beginning. So let's work together as we go down and as we work on it, because I know it's coming down the pike uh, for gay marriage in the District of Columbia. So let's all work together. Let's understand each other before we point fingers. And that goes to the community on my left and the community on my right. Let's come to the middle. Let's all work together. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Alexander. Further